confident of your care and helped by the Holy Spirit, we pray for the church, the world, and all who are in need. You take resources that appear to be meager, bless them, and there is enough. May your church trust that what you bless and ask us to share with the world is abundantly sufficient. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Your bountiful creation offers sustenance and life for all creatures. Protect this abundance for the well-being of all. Reverse the damage we have caused your creation. Replenish groundwater supplies. Provide needed rains in places of drought. And protect forests from wildfires. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. You offer yourself to all the nations and peoples of the earth, inviting everyone to abundant life. Bring the prophetic vision to fullness that all nations will run to you and that nations who do not know you will find their joy in you. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. You open your hand and satisfy the desire of every living thing. Hear the anguish of tender hearts who cry to you in suffering and satisfy their deepest needs. Bring wholeness and healing to those who suffer in body, heart, soul, and mind. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. You offer freely the fullness of salvation. Give St. Paul's such a welcoming heart that our words and actions may extend your free and abundant hospitality to all whom we encounter. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. You gather your saints as one, united in the body of Jesus. Bring us with all your saints to the heavenly banquet. We remember with love and thanksgiving the saints we have known. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The peace of Christ be with you all. Peace. We continue with a canticle of thanksgiving. Salvation belongs to our God and to Christ the Lamb forever and ever. Great and wonderful are your deeds, O God of the universe. Just and true are your ways, O ruler of all the nations. Who can fail to honor you, Lord, and sing the glory of your name? Salvation belongs to our God and to Christ the Lamb forever and ever. For you alone are the Holy One, and blessed is the one whose name is the Word of God. All praise and thanks to you, holy God. Salvation belongs to our God and to Christ the Lamb forever and ever. Let us pray. Praise and thanks to you, holy God, for by your word you made all things. You spoke light into darkness called forth beauty from chaos, and brought life into being. For your word of life, O God, we give you thanks and praise. By your word, you called your people Israel to tell of your wonderful gifts, freedom from ta- captivity, water on the desert journey, a pathway home from exile, Wisdom for life with you. For your word of life, O God, we give you thanks and praise. Through Jesus Christ, your word made flesh, you speak to us and call us to witness. Forgiveness through the cross, life to those entombed by death, the way of your self-giving love. For your word of life, O God, We give you thanks and praise. Send your spirit of truth, O God. Rekindle your gifts within us. Renew our faith. Increase our hope. And deepen our love for the sake of a world in need. Faithful to your word, O God, 
draw near to all who call on you. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit be honor and glory forever. Amen. Gathered into one by the Holy Spirit, let us pray as Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. And now receive the blessing. The God of steadfastness and encouragement grant you to live in harmony with one another in accordance with Christ Jesus. Amen. The God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing so that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The God of all grace bless you now and forever. Amen. We're sent forth with St. Paul's mission and vision statements. People of God, we've been given a mission. St. Paul's Lutheran family lifts high the cross to proclaim the good news of God's love to all people. People of God, we've been given a vision. The vision of St. Paul's Lutheran family is to seek God's path for our lives and the life of the church, and to compassionately lead, serve, and share Jesus Christ with the community and world. People of God, we have much work to do. For every house is built by someone, but the builder of all things is God. That verse comes from Hebrews chapter 3, verse 4. And now we're sent forth with our sending song.